What's it like for you to be here tonight? I'm so thrilled to be here, Stephanie. It's Onward, it's Disney, Pixar. Uh, we're in Hollywood, it's the premiere. And it's, you can feel the excitement in the air. It's amazing, it's amazing. I cannot tell you how happy and privileged I am to be in a Pixar movie. It's a real milestone for me. Like I've always wanted to be in one and here we are today. And it's especially special because I'm doing it with one of my best mates, Chris Pratt. Dan Scanlon, our director, did such a wonderful job telling this really personal story and I'm just really, really excited to see it and share it with the fans. And how was the process finding a voice for Barley? It was a roundabout process. We tried a lot of different things and ultimately ended with a voice that's just really similar to my own voice. Um, we, you know, uh, it took a few sessions to zero in and figure out what we wanted to do because there's this rock, this death metal rock nature to this character. So we leaned into some of that stuff and at the end of the day they just wanted to really make these uh, modern fantasy elf characters very human and so that's what we ended up doing. It was tricky actually, it took a while. I was recording for Spies in Disguise at the same time, just bouncing between the two and Dan wanted me to sort of ground my voice a little bit and make it a little bit deeper so that it felt, felt a little bit more grounded and connected the character with Chris a little bit more. Um, so it took a while for us to figure out the voice but we got there eventually and I'm pretty happy with where we landed. Finding the voice of the Manticore at all um, is attributed to Dan. He really knew all of the characters inside and out, and I came in with this crazy idea of what I wanted the Manticore's voice to be. And we, you know, we went through all of those and realized it was probably more of a, um, a, a practical approach because my voice wouldn't have been able to sustain the stuff that I was doing. <laughs> so it was a process, and it's, it was a, a fun process. Can you talk a little bit about uh, casting Chris and Tom for this brother? Yeah, uh, we're so lucky and we're so excited that they're uh, in the film. Um, with Tom, we um, we just needed somebody who could portray a 16, an awkward, shy 16-year-old, but with the charm um, so that he is a really likable character. And, and nobody other than Tom Holland could pull that off as well um, as he can. So that was amazing. And then Chris? Yeah, and then Barley is a very wild, chaotic character. And Chris is so energetic and funny, um, and he brings a real heart to Barley. How do you relate to Barley, this character? It's so funny, people say that they see Barley in me and I know that Barley is a big, gregarious, kind-hearted dimwit. And I think, yeah, I guess that makes sense. Yeah, so I'm kind of like him. Yeah.